The Inner Sphere Chronicles, with your host, Walter Tucker. Join me now as I examine the events and decisions, both past and present, that have shaped the course of human history across the Inner Sphere. In September of 3057, the Free World's League military launched a joint campaign with the Capellan Confederation that targeted several planets controlled by the Federated Commonwealth, particularly Davion-held planets. These attacks were in retaliation for Victor Steiner Davion's decision to cover up the death of Joshua Merrick, son of Captain General Thomas Merrick, and replace the boy with a double after Joshua died of leukemia while being treated at the new Avalon Institute of Science. Dubbed Operation Guerrero, the Free World's League and Capellan Confederation were both successful beyond their wildest dreams, taking back several worlds that had been lost to them since before the Fourth Succession War. Operation Guerrero also succeeded in destabilizing the region, creating the hotbed of contested worlds known as the Chaos March. Victor's decision would have further ramifications, as his sister, Catherine Steiner Davion, saw the debacle as her window to secede the Lyran half of the Federated Commonwealth from the nation built by their now legendary parents, bringing an effective end to their legacy and kicking off the Fedcom Civil War. So just how important is the life of one child? In the case of Joshua Merrick, his death and the cover-up that came afterwards was significant enough for nations to go to war. One life lost, and look at the difference. I'm Walt Tucker, and this has been an Inner Sphere Chronicle. The Inner Sphere Chronicles is written by David Martin, with additional material by George Ledoux. Produced and performed by George Ledoux and Voices in My Head Productions. Any similarity to persons living or dead is a product of your imagination.